Well, keeping people safe on North Carolina's roads is a really tall order, but the Highway Patrol says it is up to the task. CBS 17's Janice Price joining us live this morning from the Highway Patrol's training center with what troopers are doing today to help make sure people get very safely from A to B. Janice. Uh, good morning, Bill. The Click It or a Ticket campaign kicked off today, and a part of that campaign, the Highway Safety Program is using this car to demonstrate why you need to wear your seatbelt. This car will be involved in a simulation, a car accident where dummies will be inside not wearing their seatbelts. The point here is to make sure everyone inside the car is wearing a safety belt. Now, joining me to explain more about the Click It or a Ticket campaign is Mark. Mark Ezel, he's the director of the Highway Safety Program, and you told me that the Click It or Ticket campaign has been around for about 25 years. Uh, talk to me about some of the changes you've noticed in the driving patterns. Well, the main thing uh, that we're pleased at is that people tend to wear their seat belts in the front seat. Over 91% of people in North Carolina do that. The concern that we have is that the back seat use is not nearly as high. And uh, you can be very seriously injured in a back seat crash in which you're not wearing your seat belt. It's dangerous to you and it's dangerous to the driver. So we encourage everyone riding in the back seat of a car, whether they're taking Uber, whether they're in Lyft, taxi, or their own vehicle, to buckle up in the back seat and the front seat as well. All right, thank you so much, Mark. A part of this campaign would include enhanced patrols. Uh, last year in Wake County, there were 300 uh, seatbelt violations. In Raleigh, Jamise Price, CBS 17 News.